Hey guys, X Brown Bear here. Welcome back to another episode of XCOM Enemy Within Long War. Uh, classic Iron Man difficulty. I almost said the, the old one, Enemy Within the Possible Iron Man mode. But um, I caught myself. So, okay, let's take a look at the squad we're going to bring in. So, I, I'm really grateful that we got a lot of participation because I was basically able to field um, everybody. Oh, so that's kind of weird. Every time I have to re. Re add who I want to bring each time because I, I don't know why it might, might be a little bug because I already had it saved the team that I want to bring in, but looks like I got changed again. Um, so let me just double check every everybody again to make sure. Um, I think I had one other person that was new. Okay, so these are gonna be the six people I, I brought because these are the six names I got. I think I had a few more, but they had a few specific requests so. I'll, I'll find somebody for them in the future, but um, so my plan is I'm gonna try train three more advanced people and then three private first classes, which are the are the rookies every mission. So here's why I've equipped. Everyone has a carbine, and what a carbine does uh, for people who don't know is it, it's basically you trade off I think one damage, but you get a little accuracy. Accuracy. So just think about it as the light plasma rifle equivalent of crappy ballistic weapons. And I'm going to be carrying a lot of grenades on my engineer. Uh, two AP grenades and two high explosive grenades. And then everyone else, since she can't aim, there's no point even giving her a laser sight. <laughs> She's probably not going to hit crap anyways. Everyone else, I have laser sights as well. So they'll all have decent aim. Their damage will be pretty low. So hopefully I only run into one pod at a time that's gonna be the plan so then I'll be able to you know between six of them and um, a few grenades if I need to we'll be able to neutralize them our medic our medic is carrying the medikit obviously and then um, uh, these are your smoker flashbangs I think these are flashbangs yeah okay so Nat and Lever will be carrying our flashbangs in case we get into a little trouble and then Lake Cajur <laughs> I, I, I can't pronounce French names too well, but uh, I, I think I won't be able to help myself trying to pronounce it in a crappy French accent. But um, he's gonna be carrying a smoke grenade to backup. So yeah, oh yeah, the Moral Thorn. He'll be he has a he also has a backup uh, high explosive grenade just in case. So I'm gonna carry more of these, even though they do less damage, but they blow up cover. So I think that's gonna be more important for me. At least early on. At least from what I think. Oh yeah, w one more thing that one mentioned. So thank you for um, someone who reminded me t to fix the research bug in Beta 9A. So apparently, at lower difficulties, the aliens research faster than in higher difficulties, which could be a problem because I don't want to run into like plasma wielding. Ethereals on month four or something crazy like that. Okay, I don't think that's gonna happen, but <laughs> you, you get the point. So I'll, I'll post a link um, to how you can fix that yourself if you have if you play Long War. You're like, oh my god, I'm getting wrecked by advanced aliens. I don't know what's going on, and everyone's telling me to suck it up. But um, there's actually a real bug, so I'll link that in the video description. And yeah, so let's get started. Okay, so it looks like the mission's gonna be right next door at this little. Our target ah, I, I don't like. I don't like this map. I don't like this map at all. Oh yeah, so one one little thing to do. If, oh, okay, I like this map now. <laughs> well, one little thing to do when you start the map or start long war campaign for the new people is to uh, click Alt F10. I I did that um, off screen. Uh, what's it called? When I was setting up the soldiers, and this refreshes the maps to make sure that I think it's a little bug where you might get the same map again. Um, so just do that if this is your first time playing Long War. Um, okay, so the reason I don't like this map is there's, there's like no cover, and there's not really a good way to flank enemies. So I don't like this map. I don't like not having cover. You guys? I don't like not being able to flank. It's pretty obvious. <laughs> Important things that I'll need, right? So, uh, I think there's a button to Overwatch everybody, but I can't remember it. So you just gotta do. 
Okay. Someone just suicided up there. I'm fine with that. I won't complain. Did you just see that? That must have been, that was a weird, weird bug. But like I said, I'm not gonna complain if the aliens wanna kill each other. And, and no, 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 just stay on the ground. You don't need to fly. Okay. Okay, okay, you can die though if you, if you wanna fly and die. Okay, wow. That was a pretty effective turn. I'm glad I took those carbines. And we're gonna we're gonna bring a whole world of pain to these aliens. Aye, aye. Only a sandwich. You're going to um, you're going to you're going to kill this guy for me. You better kill this guy for me. Okay, never mind. You're not gonna kill this guy for me. But I think our engineer though, no, you probably can't even hit them. Um. 61% chance on this guy. That's not too bad. Maybe I'll have you kill this guy if someone can run over here for me. Gaston! I, I trust you, but um, that could take two shots, though. So I don't know if I want to move Gaston. Um, or I could just blow these guys up with a grenade. Yeah, I'll, I think I'll do that. I'll blow up their co Oh, these are cars. It's not even going to blow up their cover. Oh, let's worry about the drone then first. The drone's not behind any cover. So, let's start shooting him. So, now I kind of like this map. So it's, okay, I don't want to jinx myself now, but we definitely got a lucky first turn. We even got the meld right away. So, yeah, why don't we toss an armor piercing grenade? No, no, I can't. Why don't we toss a high explosive grenade? And, um, set, set the stuff on fire and then weaken them too. Or just outright kill one of them. Sure, we can do that. And then... No, you're still behind cover, but we got quite a few shots. So we're just gonna take shots until we kill. Hopefully one of these sh sh many shots kills him. Um, but I don't think my chance is gonna be that. I don't wanna move forward though, because I won't reveal any more aliens yet. I'm gonna just keep shooting. Uh, okay, maybe Nat. Nat, you, you wanna finish the job for me. When you love us. Yeah, you got an extra 2% chance to hit it. I know you can do this. Or not. That's okay, it's just a 1 HP alien. What can he do but one shot me with a crit? Oh, he can miss. Oh, what the heck? Why are there sectoids behind me? Okay, no, that's not fine, whoever said that. Because I just wasted all my ammo on this guy without thinking that there could be more aliens behind. Okay, but we're going to hopefully kill the ball this turn, though. And you still got pistols, at least. Okay, um... I mean... I think I could kill all of these guys this turn, to be honest. And unfortunately, can't chuck a grenade that far. So, it might seem weird for me to not take cover this direction, but I'm pretty confident I can. I mean, soften them up with a grenade. Okay, well, we were just blowing all of them up. Actually, I shouldn't really do that. I was. It's kind of ironic, but I'm actually hoping to injure them so that I can grab their stuff rather than just outright kill them. Um, but the good thing is I will be grabbing a few promotions for it. Oh, no point even shooting with you. Somehow he got out of line of sight, or he was never in line of sight. Yeah, okay, maybe Sandwich can move up and then be able to see him now. 36% chance. Still not that great. Nat, can you hit him this turn? No. Well, we'll just have to move up on him. I don't want to waste a grenade on him because I already blew up too many of them. No. We can't hit. I don't know why we can't hit. Actually, let's take one shot with a pistol in case we get really lucky and then we'll reload. 
Okay, that, that, that doesn't happen. Um, no, that's not why I wanted. Okay, well. Um, okay, so that was a very anticlimactic mission, so to say. Everyone, everyone just blew up, so it'll probably be another mission just to speed things around. So I, I, I actually didn't expect my grenades to do that much damage because of what I expected from the playthrough before. Um, looks like you're gonna be another medic since we need more medics always. And then, oh, what the heck? Oh, we're doing a random class with you. Oh, great. You're an infantry. So, yeah, that actually wasn't supposed to happen, but, uh, sure, why not? Let's, let's get a, uh, fission generator. And yeah, let's keep moving forward. We'll have our ships done soon, so that'll be useful. A new request. See what request do we have? They want a satellite. No, we're not. Just going to uh, since they are offering substantial amounts to our efforts to help police their air space. So if I give them a satellite, does that place it up there as well? I'm guessing it does. So maybe we'll think about doing that when the time comes. All the uh, great auto loader. It's a strange word pronounced. Move faster. Oh, yeah, so I guess it doesn't update correctly. So, usually, I'm not a fan of shivs, but um, I think they might help against Thin Man. Let's keep moving forward. Mexico. Oh man, do you have an alien base? A small UFO. Okay. Um, let's use the avalanche missile since it's a small UFO. Okay, he's pretty fast. Look at him. We have eyes on the bandit. You got aim better than that. Oh, what the heck? Miss all your shots. Contact detected. You gotta aim a little better than that pilot, whatever your name is. Oh, come on, he's right in front of you. You, you could catch up to him. <laughs> okay, it was just him gaining elevation. That's how I'm at. Hey! Uh. Well, that's really embarrassing. We didn't hit with any of our missiles. We fired eight missiles at him. This small scout has like a thousand evasion. Yeah, well, like, keep throwing crap at him until he either runs away or we grab it. Oh man, I lost the interceptor. <laughs> okay, well, I should have probably boarded it a little earlier. Um, I underestimated the small scout. Yeah, that was actually cut kind of bad. Please shoot them now. Okay, thank God. Central, this is Voodoo 37. We have a confirmed kill on Bogey 001. I repeat, the UFO is down. I'll copy over. Solid copy, Voodoo 37. Nice work. Central out. All right, people. Retask Recon Satellite Bravo and get me a visual on that crash site. She's coming into range now, sir. On screen. Magnify. Still in one piece. Commander, I recommend we get a strike team to the crash site immediately. Yeah, I don't think the, the ship's gonna look exactly like that. Hey, what if I accidentally shot down the, uh, a battleship hypothetically on the first mission? <laughs> Would it still show a small scout? Where's that? Uh, um, yeah, okay. So, yeah, we're not going to... We're going to bring in... Uh, so someone hasn't picked the name for the Rocketeer yet, so actually, let, let's not bring that Rocketeer. Uh, who can we bring in? Well, we're going to bring in the people who didn't get a promotion. Uh, like, two infantry... Uh, let's 
keep these guys out still. So if you guys want to volunteer for these other people, feel free to, you know, say something. Uh, Moral, Moral Thorn or Ace We've got two medics. Who has the better stats? We'll bring one of you this mission and one of you another mission. Um, looks like... It's like Moral Thorn has the better stats. So let's bring in this mission and then... Uh, next mission we'll bring in um, a sandwich uh, let's okay so uh, who, who else was our named rookies uh, let's see are there other named rookie already get promoted yeah I guess they did but we don't need two medics anyway so um, okay maybe maybe we could just get a random private promoted and who had really good aim? I didn't use her yet. Uh, he told me I already set her up. She, uh, she only has five HP though, so it's gonna be a little squishy. Um, Ozzy, do we need two infantry? Maybe not. Maybe we don't need. Ah, you know what? We we, we probably could use the extra heavy, extra firepower, right? So it's probably the team we're gonna bring in: Moral Thorn, Mori, White, Lakeshire. Ozzy, Lieber, so let's get started again. Hopefully this will be a little bit more exciting than me. Somehow accident somehow unintentionally blowing them all up into smithereens. We have visual on the mission. Okay, so okay, that was a very long flight. We could have just walked there apparently. The site is near the German border. Uh, I've actually never seen that happen where uh what's it called? It was only a, a one minute flight, or it might have been a few minutes actually. So it probably took longer to take off from the base than to, um, what's it called? Yeah, okay. Forgot what I was saying. Okay, let's have you, let's not have you move him. I need to get rid of um, some of the bad habits that I developed late game of the last playthrough. Usually what happens in... in near the end. Uh, actually, I think it's okay. If, if we discover anything, we can just back up. Yeah, but let's not move all the way because uh, I'm, I'm afraid. I'm afraid of oh, discovering something on this turn. And I'm afraid that I'll be over here and then you won't be in cover because that's how you lose people. Um... Uh, we're just going to move everybody. We can move you, you a little. We can have you dash at least. And then we'll just put you in between these guys. So, I actually don't like it that they only have three bullets, but I'm used to ha them having um, four. So, I, I gotta take that into consideration before I just start shooting. Okay, so. They're coming to us. I, maybe the aliens in Long War are a bit more aggressive because usually I don't run into aliens as often on my own accord. Let's see, where are they moving? And that guy's moving into a funky position. Oh no, he's just taking an Overwatch. Great, great hit, great hit. Uh, another thing I worry about just you know Overwatching rather than just setting my weapon the first turn is that uh, what's it called? I'm using all my shots. For not very good aims, which could be problematic. Nice, nice. What, what do you say? Do you say planted them? So who's tanky and wants to stand in front? Who's tanky and fast enough and wants to stand in front? Lake on sure is. So maybe I should just steady my weapon, wait for them to come to me. Yes, maybe Natalia could check a flashbang at them. Can you throw that far? No, you can't. Oh, but you're you have a pretty good chance to hit though. So 73 is not that bad. And you did you did two minus one. Okay, could be better. Um, Lieber, what can we bring you? That's Safe. Um, I was gonna bring Zoe here and then Lieber here. 
They don't have grenades, right? I don't think they do. Okay, I think you could take take this guy out for me. Then we just have one guy to deal with. And let's see, maybe I could, actually I don't want to bring you up forward in case we see somebody. I'm gonna my, I'm gonna steady my weapon actually uh, to preserve some ammo. And you, uh, um, the maps. The map doesn't go any further that way, but last time the aliens spawned behind me somehow, so I'm not going to take any of that. They're trying to pull back. Okay, I thought he I thought he could see all the way over there. Okay, I won't get Natalia and, and Moria kill. That's gonna be the plan. We have we have to reload though. And I don't wanna get baited by that alien. He could be trying to bait me upwards. Try to bring once one team left and one team right. I think that's okay. gonna be the plan. No, that wasn't the plan. But aliens never conform to my plans, do they? So just kidding, we're not staying here. Uh, why can't I move you? Oh no, you already- that was already your, your seconds- oh yeah, because I had you reload. That was a mistake. Shouldn't- should- I shouldn't have clicked that button before everybody was ready to, um... Oh, same note, that means I should have moved those people either. Um, but that's okay. Kind of an awkward position. This isn't like you know a really ideal. Okay, hopefully you come up and then I can just shoot them with more or something like that. Okay, yeah. Natalie's behind heavy cover, so you, you aren't you aren't hurting her. Mori, unfortunately you can't see, but you might be able to get a flank from here. Oh, nice. Perfect. Oh, nice. You even killed him, too. Actually, you might have the assault rifle over the carbine. Let me just see. Oh, they have the carbine, too. Equipped you beforehand. Um, let's see. Let's have White take, because in case they're Overwatch, uh, Natalie will have to move quite quite a bit, and she's also a bit squishier compared to Zoe. Okay, perfect. These guys aren't in great coverage, so we're going to and they're together. So let's let's blow up their cover, and maybe we can feed a kill to Natalie. Or the rocks don't blow up. Sure. But nonetheless, I I think we could try. Or, 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 I feel like Natalie's not, <laughs> Natalie likes to discover aliens, doesn't she? Okay, uh, never mind, we're not gonna do that. We're gonna try and move everybody else forward. Lieber, Lieber, you can stay here, I think. These three are gonna try to take care of that alien for me. Or, no, sorry, not Lieber, uh, Lacon, sure, you can stay. Over there. And then Lieber, Lieber, you're gonna move here. You're gonna take a quick reload. You're gonna steady your weapon in case he moves forward. Actually, you're gonna Overwatch to make it so he doesn't want to move forward. And then you, you're gonna move here and then steady your weapon. Okay, you're mind melding, or you're being mind melded. See what he does. Uh oh. Okay, okay. We got we got really lucky there. I thought we was gonna shoot. And he also, um, what's it called, misses mind fray. So I don't know if the mind fray does five damage because that that would kind of suck in this game. 
Oh, okay, good, good, good. Our, our, our troops are a bit hardy after that. We killed quite a few of their friends, so... We, we aren't afraid. Okay, unfortunately, that guy's just overwatching right there. Um, okay, okay, so, Lieber, this is gonna be your job, actually, to kill this guy for me. 100% chance to hit, can't get any better than that. I don't know if we're gonna be a feed now, Leah. Kill, unfortunately. Uh, I don't want to get hit by an Overwatch, but I might not have have a choice. Yeah, I can't even see that far. Okay, hopefully this will be the first move that provides you into sight. Okay, great, it was. Oh, but sight on this guy, not that guy even. Nat, your chance of hit isn't too bad, so maybe we could just hit him a whack at once. Ah, no. You have your weapon steady too, right? Uh, except your chance of hit isn't that great. You could flashbang him. Nope. Um, it's a little tricky. Oh, so this is the edge of the map. Maybe we can move someone around here. Let's do this. I want to try to move Moral Thorn all the way around the map, and then try to go for a flank on the left side. Since on this side we're kind of pinned now. We're gonna Overwatch. We're gonna Overwatch. Um, Lake Con Actually, maybe I should just take this shot. These aren't the best shots, though. I don't know if I want to take a shot. I don't really feel like retreating from here. I can, I can smoke up. I think I'll do that. Yeah, maybe I'll retreat Mori to try to get this guy to go left, and then maybe I could flank with um, whoever that is over there. Um, I'm kind of afraid that you'll get hit by an Overwatch, so maybe I'll just hunker down then. And then White, White, you'll 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 Overwatch again to prevent them from moving forward. Okay, you're gonna mind mind melt. Okay, well, so maybe there'll be a way to whack two of these guys. Ow! Four damage. It's got painful. He's Overwatch now. Um, let's see. I, can, I think I can move around. Okay, perfect. 60% chance, pretty good. But I want to see if I can whack the other guy. Anything. You're kind of injured. I don't know if I want to keep you up front, but you, and you, yeah, there's red fog, so it's not like you hit that well. Natalie, um, prefer if I'd be able to throw a grenade at this guy to weaken him. We're going we'll to use our grenade, I think, because we'll get two of them, and then one of them will still get the weapons fragments. And we don't kill him, I think it'll blow up the cover, so... Or not. I guess grenades aren't strong enough to break up rocks. Uh, but, Nat. Okay, this is up to you, Nat. I I'm really counting on you right here. To please hit this guy. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Good job, Nat. And, okay, so I guess the mind melt doesn't instantly kill people, but that's okay. Hopefully, we can kill him. Oh, nice. 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 Very nice. Lieber, Lieber, we can move you up now a little bit. Okay, we're gonna retreat you back here. Actually, if I run that way, I might get in trouble. So we're gonna run you this way. Here you go. You're gonna swap positions with. Um... Okay, you're not gonna swap positions this turn, but next turn you're gonna try. You're gonna swap positions with that alien there. Alright, sorry, what? Actually, I said it right. You already got swap positions, but uh, he's not gonna swap positions with you. 
All right, that, that was late claw share. Uh, <laughs> I just noticed these both G, uh, G L names are gonna probably throw me off. It's gonna be like it's gonna be like Weapon and Wolf again from the last episode, especially since they're both the same class. These uh, if I get this confused, uh, no hard feelings. It's just me and my poor memory. If, if you guys remember, Mori, ah uh, no, tell me you you be able to get a lucky shout off. Okay, so I wonder if that was a survivor from the first alien <laughs> group. He's like, okay, I lost my first group of friends, and now not my second group of friends kind of just died. Oh my god, good job, Nat. Really good job. You, you, you get you get a combination for that. That was a much needed kill. So I guess we just move forward a little bit, reload. We try to. Actually, no, no, no. We're not. We're not gonna do it like this, like last time. And then bring us into trouble, but I'd rather not, you know, try to bring our two injured people together. I wonder how much medicates heal on this map. 5 HP might be a bit risky to you ca just carry on somebody. Yeah, okay, yeah, we're, we're, gonna, we're gonna move backwards. We're, just, we're gonna heal everybody and reload, basically. And get everybody into new positions. That's gonna be the plan for it the next one or two turns. Uh, you're gonna overwatch and then you're gonna reload. You're gonna reload as well. We still got one alien, and depending on how much damage Mind Freight does, that, that can actually still be a little risky, so I don't wanna just, you know, go crazy. Okay, we're, we're gonna heal him. Because I don't know how risky Long War is, uh. Or how crazy Long War is, but I know it's pretty crazy, so I want to take every precaution I can. So, heals three right now. That's not that great. So, that, that couldn't even heal him since he took four damage. But uh, we're not going to do anything this turn because I'm going to try to bring everybody into position. Because, just in case there's still the outsider, I don't know if there's an outsider on the. And long war at the start, but just in case, okay. probably gonna need our grenades. It's gonna be pretty hard to kill an outsider if it's the same statistics from Iron Man or from Impossible at least. Um, yeah, I guess you could. Sorry about this. We're, we're, we're just gonna stay here for one more turn just so I can bring the rest of our team up. If it's just one sectoid, well, I feel a little silly, but. At least I took the precaution. Because your guys' lives are kind of important to me. For your sake and my sake. <laughs> I, I get attached to everyone. If, if, if you guys didn't watch the Iron Man Possible uh, playthrough, I, I get attached to everyone. So if anyone dies, we're gonna, we're, I'm going to give you guys the fanciest memorial you guys could have. But we're not going to kill it. We're not going to have anybody die. That's, that's the plan. A pretty tough plan, but but hey, we haven't lost anybody yet, even though it's, this is only the third mission. Yeah, okay, that's kind of dangerous to bring everybody too far up, but is, there could still be an outsider, like I said. That one sectoid is running for the hills. And this map has kind of funky vision, it looks like. Okay, so there is an outsider. And he's very, very tanky. Uh, but his chance to hit isn't, isn't the greatest, look like. Okay, you're not going to fight an outsider by yourself. So my plan is I want to be able to flashbang him if possible. And no, it's, um, it's not possible. But uh, I'd probably whack him at least once. If anything, I'll be shooting at Natalie. Because Natalie is the squishier person. Um, I want to get you into a good position next turn, though. Actually, we, we still have a sectoid to worry about. 
It's only one guy, but he's still a guy with a plasma pistol, so that will still be a little cautious. Let's try to get everybody into a position on the left flank of this outsider. So we got a funky foot formation here, we got a little circle. Fortunately, he told me you're gonna ruin the circle. Uh, it's kinda, kinda cool if I put her here, but we're not gonna put her here because that one wouldn't make any sense. A little worried about Natalie's position in case the um, sectoid comes or in case the outsider gets a lucky shot off. See what he does though. Oh wow, he can regenerate his health. I did not know that, but you can you you can take one of these for me, please. And we got another flashbang in case you want another you want to get hit again. So can he just keep regenerating health because that would not be very cool. Okay, I, I think just so we can... Mm, let's see, where's our Grenadier? Oh, but you only have armor piercing grenades left. Maybe I should have carried our high explosive grenade. Should have one, right? Or was it? No, you threw the flashbang. You have the other flashbang. Okay, maybe I have a lot of flashbangs, but I don't have enough regular grenades. Um, that's okay. Let's move more. Uh, his aim should be really low, right? It should be okay. Or he can't. He's not gonna even take the Overwatch because he's too busy crying. Or we can just start missing. We can do that. Oh, right, nice. You're actually gonna just chuck a grenade for for me. Actually, I, I think without the flashbang, he he might be almost be pot really hard to hit, kill. Without uh, taking down quite a few of us, so I'm glad I brought three flashbangs. <laughs> I probably didn't need that many, but uh, um, but it's all right. 83% chance to hit. That's pretty good. Oh man, that it's okay. You did your job last turn at least. Have you run over here so we can start flanking him next turn? Oh, we still got the sectoid. We'll deal with him later. He, he's too afraid anyways. Are you gonna regenerate two more health? Oh no, he, he can only regenerate. Oh, you're gonna regenerate three health? That's a joke. Here, take another one of these. And... Mori, uh... Actually, I, I really should try to kill him this turn, shouldn't I? Oh, no, 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 no. Don't, don't do this to me. Lieber, you can take two shots. You better hit at least one of these. Hey, hey, hey. This isn't allowed here. Um, uh-oh. Might need to flash. Oh, yeah, maybe I should just take down the sectoid. Now we have to whack him again with their flashbang. Please don't regenerate any more health because because that's not very cool. Okay, uh, we got two shots. Maybe I could just if Lakeon sure hits, that'd be great. Okay, he didn't hit. So please take another one of these. Please don't regenerate any more health. Oh man. Now you're behind. Full cover. Okay, Zoe. So, since you're out of grenades, you're gonna be our. 
or dummy. He's right next to you. How can you not hit him? Oh, what the heck? You're out of ammo. Uh, luckily, you can flank him. Yeah, okay. Please, please hurt him a lot. Guns, dry. Guns all dry. Uh, Nat, would you like to do the favors? You already got a promotion, though, so. Well, maybe you'll end up doing the favors first, anyway. Please kill him. Oh, thank God. He got a promotion. Okay, so that, that that guy was a bit tough. I'm glad I brought all those flashbangs. <laughs> a lot of people got promotions. Lake Kosher got wounded for a very long time. Uh, yeah, so this gives you aim as well. Or recall targeting. That's not a bad idea. But... I think we want low profile. Well, I mean, I guess low profile isn't as good in this game, so, but you're gonna be gone for a long time anyway. So we're just gonna give you low profile. Maybe we'll give someone else a more team-oriented thingy. Grenades do additional damage to enemies, and all your weapons do additional damage to the environment. That sounds good. Reaction. Your aim's already crap. You're, you're hopeless. So we're not gonna worry about that. Um, Play the smoke grade once per mission. Smoke covers taking the part on level up also allows an additional move after deploying a smoke grenade. Wait, wait, wait. wait. Let's read that again. It's out. That sounds pretty useful. Or sapper. We're kind of using you as a sapper anyway, so we'll take this. So maybe we'll be able, you'll be able to blow up cover now. Mori. So if you, any of you guys want to be hurt, um, let me know. We already have someone with lightning reflexes, so we're gonna use squad sight on her. Her aim's gonna, her aim's pretty good too, so that's good. Oh, not not a sniper again. Uh, her aim isn't as good though. So maybe you should be instead of a sniper, you should be our lightning. You should be a up front and close. Oh, okay. So I, once you get promoted, you get a bunch of aim. So you're gonna be our. That's gonna be a, a snapshot sniper, or I guess it's still a. I guess snapshots lower down the tree, so. Yeah, that's gonna be who you are. Yeah, okay, so. Oh, we got some stuff to sell. So I heard I should only sell damage things and nothing else. So we're gonna do that. Only sell damage stuff. And. Should I build another satellite? Maybe I build another satellite. Should I, should I, maybe I should replace the aircraft aircraft we lost no we're not doing that because that was a $200 aircraft that I just blew up well frick I'm not gonna do that again in the future abduction sites okay Tokyo Japan $96 so that's gonna be um, tomorrow tomorrow the day after his mission it's a little hard to upload every single day because like I said, I'm back at my um, folks' home for um, just to visit them for a month this summer. So it's gonna be a little. Their internet isn't the greatest. It's gonna be a little hard to, you know. Uh, what's it called? Um, what was I saying? It's gonna be a little hard to upload constantly because it takes like eight hours to upload an episode. But uh, I'll, I'll try to upload at least every other day, and that'll be the minimum. So I, I think that's gonna be it. If um, still a few people who you know need a need someone to adopt them, so let's say Zoe White, Eon Wilson, Gabriel Santiago, and those uh, he tell me more. So if any of you guys want to be any of these classes, then let me know because these people need a name. And then I have so many more rookies that need to get trained up. I probably I probably need to recruit more rookies as well sooner or later because people are getting wounded and fatigued. So, 
Yeah, it's probably gonna be using quite a lot of people. Oh wow, you have a lot of will, Esteban Martinez. But your aim is crap. Anyway, so I think that's gonna be it. If you enjoyed this episode, feel free to leave a like. And then, yeah, if you want to join, leave your name, your bio, your nickname. Um, you know what language pack you want, customization, all all the good good stuff. And if you want to see more, please click that subscribe button. So thanks for watching, guys. Xmarbear signing out.